hello guys welcome to my channel my name is joseph benson in today's video i want to give you my quick workaround on my home build helicopter design that i use um to construct the benson b1 ultralight helicopter and i'm using this software to design my ultralight helicopter um anyway i'm an architect um but the passion for flight um, never escaped my mind if this is your first time make sure to subscribe to my channel and click on that bell notification icon so if i have a new video you will be notified please like this video because if you like this video you are really um, telling youtube a lot within that this video is very very important and i'll show this video to as many people as possible so today i will be giving you my quick workaround on my home build ultralight helicopter and what we need to do here if you see this if you watch this video and you're okay with the plan you can let me know on the comment section below that you're okay with the plan so i just need 10 comments from different people that they need the plan and i'm gonna um pdf this um working drawing and add it to my to the video description and you can go ahead and download it and use it on your own or you can easily modify this drawing on your own and you can use it i'm using the autocad 2020 version this is autocad you can see autodex autocad 2020 version and i was be able to create this um diy ultralight helicopter steel frame airframe project design okay you can see consultants is telling me just a benson steel fabrication and those are stages build stages okay everything i was be able to explain in this little drawing and you can see the first uh, first begin with the main base airframe chassis you know i was be able to keep everything simple then the next um, the next is to construct the landing kit you can see it here and after that is to construct the tail boom then construct the head airframe which is the fuselage and then um the next fixing of seat and seat belt i was be able to construct to draft stages through build okay so this will be a guide for you and all you need to know about um the benson b1 ultralight helicopter so this next page, uh, pages is about um the main base airframe which is um the main base of the ultralight helicopter and you can see that um i have everything the the main base of the ultralight aircraft is two meters long and um and the width is 60 centimeter which is 600 mm width which is a weight of it and you can see the engine compartment it's 40 centimeter by two by 52 kind of centimeter everything is been um set properly this is the main chassis um which uh, the engine and the fuselage will sit on and you can see that um the space between um this pipe right here the square pipe here it's where the um, the cyclic will be and that is also where we're going to install the pedals but if you watch my previous video on the benson b1 ultra helicopter i was be able to explain one or two things and you would see all of this in this video so if you did not watch those previous video please go ahead and watch this video because this video will speak more to the plan please again make sure you like this video because if you like this video you are telling youtube algorithm that this video is very important and they will show it as many people has possible so you can see the um, the cuts the size the angle everything is been there for you to see and that is it so i just need 10 people to just say we like this video we need the plan in pdf and i'm going to pdf this plan and drop it in the video link and in the video description below it and you can go you guys can go ahead and download it and also uh, kind of um re-edit it and also use it okay then um we have the landing gear skit which is the landing gear skit is right here and all you need to know about the landing gear skit is here i was be able to give this dimension very very neat and clean and all the cutting all um the size uh, like the cut 80 centimeter two pieces cut 70 centimeter four pieces cut 200 centimeter which is two meters cut it two pieces um cut 15 centimeter cut it four pieces this is a 15 centimeter over here okay this little kind of um bending um, here is a 15 centimeter so um, anything everything you have to do I was be able to sim simplify this very very easy I try my best to make sure that um, you guys understand this please uh, if you don't understand this video please you can write um, to me in the comment section below and 
hopefully i will be able to explain one or two things about this um my ultralight plan and all you need to know about um the aircraft so you can see that um this is the details about the landing skit and i hope you learn one or two things about um this landing skit the details is right there you can easily start constructing this ultralight right away from the comfort of your home in your garage and the next page um is a tail boom and you can see the tail boom if you watch my previous video about the tail boom i was be able to explain all you need to know the size you can see is 2.5 centimeter um, 2.5 um meters and you can see the width of it um the diameter of the of the of the tail boom is eight centimeter okay have this in the back of your mind the diameter is eight centimeter which is 18 millimeter and that is it those are just normal support frame to support it and that is it so this is a side view And this is the um, tail boom section. Okay, this is all you need to know about the section, uh, the tail boom itself. This video is quite a really uh, short one. I decided to show you guys um, what you need to know about this ultralight helicopter. So this is the shaft that take power from the um, from the uh, transmission system that, and give the tail rotor. Okay, this is the shaft that give tail rotor. Those are bearing housing and you can see those are block bearing housing and we have four block bearing housing that can transfer the shaft so if you watch my previous video about my ultralight benson b1 ultralight helicopter i was be able to explain much about this um, tail boom and you see the in how i was be able to install this shaft that took power from the main transmission to the tail rotor i was be able to explain all you need to know about um that tail boom in that video so um this is like a complete airframe um work design um just giving you guys the details so this is the support frame i was showing you guys the other time and this is just like kind of review and kind of a rough sketch but with useful dimensions um you may not see this to be kind of beautiful or good looking to see but this is kind of a rough sketch of benson b1 but it has useful information useful dimension all the dimension you need to know about my home build ultralight helicopter is right here i'm an architect um it's not easy for me to draw something like this but i have to take my time um using the little knowledge about architecture and i just add it up into aeronautic and i was be able to bring this design the way it is right now so and you can see this is a side view of the complete airframe um structure okay which is airframe work design which is the main structure of the airframe completely so i'm just giving you kind of quick walk around and you can be able to see how you can modify yours because modification is really really allow if maybe i'm missing one or two things you can also let me know in the comment section below and two good heads are better than one because i believe in correction so this is how my um ultralight helicopter um, side view which is the benson b1 look like then um this is the head frame which is a fuselage and the landing skit everything together this is the front view of it and you can see that you have a useful information you're supposed to know um the, to the total weight of the the landing skit gear okay the landing gear skit you need to know the total weight is 1.8 meters which is 1800 mm okay and you can see the width uh in to in it's about um 80 centimeter which is sorry it's uh, um, 80 centimeter yes that is 800 mm okay and you can see the height is 1.1 meters and you can see the width of the fuselage is 600 which is 60 centimeter it's meant for one crew and that is how simple um my home build the benson b1 ultra helicopter is. it's it's not easy for me just the way i said earlier um i'm an architect anyway but um i have to take my time and show people what really i can do and also other people to also benefit from my um kind of hard work and um it will also be of help to many people that is why i'm still begging for everyone watching this video and please to like this video because if you like this video you are really really doing me well and um they are telling youtube all agree that this video is very important and they will show this video to as many people as possible who are in search of um this particular video you are watching right now and um that will really help them a lot okay so that is it and another thing again i want to show you the fuselage um i just give you the rough sketch about the on the fuselage here but never you didn't see the dimension but this is the dimension of the fuselage and all you need to know about the fuselage which is the head where the pilot will sit is also one passenger um ultralight helicopter so this is dimension and all you need to know and the angle of 
um, and the angles to all of these cuttings, I will be able to like explain few things about it and um that is it it's not it's not easy for me but i just decided <clears throat> decided to show you guys this and this could be of help to many people uh, this is a good example of a simple free sludge and that is it so the free sludge is really one of a kind and um i just need 10 people to tell me that this plan is very very interesting and beautiful I should give them the link and I'll drop the link to this um, plant in the description of the video so you can go ahead and download this plant and start using it for your ultralight home build helicopter. You know, the whole of this plant is not professional, but one thing you need to know is a quick walk around to giving you idea of what you're about to do and how you should do your own probably. Okay, this is the Benson B1 once again, and um, that is it. And one of the page here is about the stages, the build stages, um, from, from the first stages to the last stages, uh, st uh, stage. Okay. Um, I hope this video really, really, um, um, give you idea of what you're about to go and how you can be able to do it. And please, if you have any question regarding this particular video, you can let me know in the comment section below. I will be glad to really assist and assist you with your question and if there's any other thing you wanted to add uh, to this drawing or to, or to my construction you are very very much welcome you are free to add one or two things and after all they said two big two good heads are better than one so please you can add your contribution it's really really allowed and needed um that is it and i do upload life changing videos like this if not every single day on this channel please make sure you subscribe to this very particular channel because i will be uploading videos about my home build helicopter update time to time and other helicopter build videos and um, that is not really from me i will just take my time and make sure that you got all those video um on your um on this channel and that will also broaden your knowledge and your search um that is it so you can tell me what you feel about this video once again in the comment section below and if there's any other related question you want to ask about the ultralight humble helicopter and you are free to ask because i think by the grace of god i can i should be able to answer one or two questions about the ultralight humble helicopter thank you so much for your time and make sure you like this video hope i'll see you next video bye bye for now